Pedro Pedro's gonna show us how to make mezcal. Agave. Agave. See, the, the agave is a plant that we need to use for mezcal. For mezcal. Wow. Are you gonna plant different types? Wow, for to me? It's huge. For to me, the, the, the mezcal in Oaxaca, we can use 12 different types. Really? Wow. Uh, in Mexico, you're gonna find over 80 different types. So you're gonna find many types. Wow. This is the type we use. Uh, this is the most popular because only that one we can cultivate. The other types are like a wild type. Okay. Oh. So this is the plant, the, the popular because we need to cultivate. We call it maguey, but it's the, plant, it is the agave. It's the agave. Same it's the same thing. Same okay. So at this time we call it maguey espadin. And we call it espadin because the leaf looks like a sword. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, espadin. Uh -huh. Oh. So we call it sore agave. Oh, okay, so this is what it looks like natural. That's what they were telling you, but the leaves would pop up. So this is the sword agave. It takes about eight or three years to grow. We waited eight years. So when it's ready to plant after eight years, they put it in the leaves, and we only use the heart of the plant. That's hard. We could pin it. The heart, the pin it. We could pin it. It does look like a pineapple. So they they could it in the pin it. I go for it. I we need to cut the pineapple. So they could it in the patch inside. Yes. And it started fire. We use fire with a green. Oh yes, so you get that so you get that fire the taste. Yeah, and the alcohol the steam comes out. We need wow. to condense on the steam. So this is the coolant. They add cold water. They condense on the steam and they get the mezcal here. Oh and that plate. That's a mezcal. Oh That's a mezcal. That's incredible. That's an actual the pure one. Wow. Can we call it yes. mezcal coming. The young one. The young one, ah, good. April, you get close, you can smell it. You smell the alcohol coming off it. We just had mezcal first time last night. Really? So now we're figuring out where it came from, and I appreciate. Yeah. And there was different brands or different types. There was a dark one. There yeah. was a light one. Mm -hmm. That's the base. That's the natural. And that one we're keeping in a bar room. So in the bar we keep mushrooms. We use uh, new white oak barrels. The, the white oak changes the color and the flavor. That's how. Okay. So here we're gonna see the difference. This is the natural mezcal, but we saw there. Yes, the that's mezcal. the way the young mezcal. I have, I have a quick question. Is this salt mixed with a spice or is it sea salt? Uh, we use chili, but oh, chili. The, the chili just for the color, so don't worry. So no salt? Yeah. And with a bit of salt, mm -hmm. but just salt. regular salt. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Okay, so, so this, this one, is not young. Yeah. We keep it in a barrel like that one. So the white oak uh, changes the color. This one rested six months in a white oak barrel. Oh my gosh. Six months. And you call means age. Okay. This one being five years in five years in a white oak barrel. Oh. And this is the special one. It's a dark one. Uh -huh. It's much longer. We call mezcal de la casa. This one being eight years. Eight years? Eight. Eight years in a white wow. oak barrel. So wow. the age ones are the smaller because they are white oak. Sure. That is but all of those have the same percentage, 40%. 40%? Yeah, but oh same difference. Yeah. How come this one is not orange? Ah, those are the liquors. Oh, oh that's yours. Yeah. For, for to make the liquors, we use natural fruits, we use honey, so the liquors have sweet. Are delicious. This is the whole specialty, it's passion fruit. It's very delicious. So, would you like to try the mezcalis? Yes, please. please. And I want to know how to use uh, the this orange. and this, okay. the orange this and that. orange. You can take a piece of orange, dip it a little bit of salt. So first drink, you need to fill the flavor. So first drink. And then you follow with that. 150. 
And we use that for our fruit. So, um, you can see they're full. So oh, you need yeah. to shake it and we go. Oh, okay, shake it first. Uh-huh, okay. because it look yours. Because they're not. Mm. So which one do you like best of these? Well, I really like the coconut one. But I, the orange one is great, but it tastes like... Um, it's like mango or something. Would you like to try yeah. new one? This one has uh, hazelnut in it and pistachio. Oh, yeah. Pistachio. Yeah, pistachio. I think the tour is going to end here. I don't think it's gonna, we're going to continue. Yeah, you can put it in there. Want to worms? We had the worms. We had the worm. I don't want to eat it, though. No, not the worm by itself. No way. Uh-uh. So far, oh my God. coconut one is the winner. This is great, too. It's great, but... Oh, yeah. Which, is the, which one is the coconut? That's the one I just tried. Yeah, that's very, very good. Yeah, I agree on that. Put it in there. It's okay.